Hello everyone, I am Dr. Dhanraj Chavan and thank you for choosing to watch this video. In this video, I am going to demonstrate the nerve block of the ankle area. We have done the markings already. This uh, can be done at two levels, one at the malleolar level and at the tarsal level. At the malleolar level, about 2-3 cm above the uh, prominence of the malleolar, both malleolar, the line connecting it. We have marked the superficial peroneal nerve which is to be blocked in between these two points, the lateral malleolus and the extensor hallucis longus tendon. And in between the extensor hallucis longus tendon and the medial malleolus is where the saphenous nerve lies. And the third superficial nerve is the sural nerve, which we can see on this side in between the points of the lateral malleolus and the Achilles tendon. So these three superficial nerves are blocked by uh, giving a ring block of subcutaneous infiltration. And we have two deep nerves. One is the deep peroneal nerve, which is which lies just lateral to the uh, tendon of the extensor hallucis longus. And we have the posterior tibial nerve, which lies in between the Achilles tendon and the lateral medial malleolus. So we palpate for the posterior tibial artery and or approximately in between the midline between these two, we go in like this and inject. So we'll first now do the superficial artery, uh, superficial nerves and then do the deep nerves. So we'll first now go for the area of the uh, saphenous nerve and we'll go in from, the, so we ask the patient to flex, uh, extend her toe. Okay. And then we see the tendon of the extensor hallucis longus. From there up to the medial malleolus, we go subcutaneously and infiltrate about 5 to 10 ml in that area. Going subcutaneously, we aspirate and inject. Extend it towards the medial malleolus. Just massage it a bit. Similarly, going laterally towards the lateral malleolus to get the superficial peroneal nerve. And then the sural nerve we go in the same line towards the Achilles tendon from the lateral malleolus. So we go in from here. This whole infiltration is done above the retinaculum. So the flexor retinaculum and the external extensor retinaculum. We go above it. The deep peroneal nerve we go just lateral to the tendon we have marked. So we feel for the tendon, ask the patient to extend her toe and then go in perpendicular to the tibia at that level medial to the tendon what is the straight to say? go in straight till we hit the tibia so I have hit the tibia come back a few millimeters aspirate and inject about 5 milliliters there In the remaining 5 milliliters, so about 20 cc is what is required totally. We palpate for the posterior tibial artery. As we go lower down, the artery and the nerve become superficial. So it becomes easier. So we have the artery here and we go in 45 degrees towards the tibia. Once we hit the tibia, we retract. So I have hit the tibia now. I just come back a few millimeters, aspirate and inject about 5 cc of the local anesthetic. So this would complete our ankle block. We blocked the 3 superficial and the 2 deep nerves. We wait about 20 to 30 minutes post giving this for maximum effect to take place. Thank you so much for watching.